Hey everyone, welcome back to Alex in the City here. And you guys know I'm afraid of heights. Below me here, I can't really show you, but I'm gonna flip the camera around just to give you guys an idea of what I'm looking at. That is the beautiful skyline of Chongqing in the background. Now we're gonna walk up this very interesting uh, area. The correct pronunciation in Chinese is Huang Hongge. It, it's an ancient trail, guys, and I've gotta show it to you guys. You can see the old walls here. Now this is going all the way back to the uh, Ming Dynasty. Now, here's what we're gonna experience in this vlog today. We're gonna experience a little bit of nostalgia. And this is once again, not one of those uh, destinations that is known by international travelers. This is known by the locals. And this really has a cool feel to it. Now, have a look at these roads in front of me here. You can see, as you have in Europe, you got cobblestones. Now these are very big rocks. These are laid out here. The old days of the porters that would come from, you see it, from the Yangtze all the way down here. They would make their way up this really ancient trail. By horseback, they would bring the goods. The vendors would come down here, all the sellers. Well now, you can sit back and you can relax and enjoy a nice tea. I was walking by some guys playing a, uh, a Chinese, what's that Chinese game are they playing? Matcha. Matcha? Yeah. Matcha. Let's have a little sneak peek of what these guys are up to. I can hear the cracking of matcha. There they are. I gotta stay quiet though, guys. These are very serious players here. Now, what can we compare that to? We compare that to maybe what we do in the West where we play a card game called Rummy or you know your neighbors would come over and I gotta tell you something about Chongqing people not only is it a hot city but the people are fiery you can hear it in their voices here they don't hold back what would you say the conversation is here so we're gonna continue our way down here and this is really interesting this is not only um, a place where you can come during the day, at night. All these restaurants, there's plenty of restaurants. Oh, and there's this hotel. All right, let's see if we can sneak into the hotel here quickly. See if they'll, they won't give us a bit of uh, flack here. Now, I would be surprised if they charged over $100 in this hotel. This is a place to kick back and relax. I don't know why I'm so quiet here, but <laughs> I'll try not to be. And you better be careful when you're walking out here because this is all glass. Sure, thank you. Well, look at this, guys. What a treat. Beautiful pool, look at this. Nice sunny day here, and it goes into the distance. Okay, guys, this pool is insane. <laughs> I can't believe, actually, people swim in it. If you go and stay at some of the hotels, restaurants, locations, in other major cities in the world, like Paris, London, New York, Amsterdam, you will pay a massive fee to get that unique hotel or that unique spot, very costly. But here in Chongqing, the prices are very affordable still, and it's a real cool city. So now we're heading on the top part of this trail, and we're going now out to near what is called the entrance, you could say, the entrance from the main road. Oh, guys, you gotta love this. I mean, isn't this beautiful? <laughs> we're still looking for food, everyone. But let me show you the incline of this road. We are now on a constant step downward motion. It's, it's like a mushroom's head with a hole in the middle. Now, would you eat that with meat or anything? Or no, would you, just. Just like it is? So why is there a big lineup here? Uh, anyway, we're gonna find out what it is. These ladies are busy. Oh, now I see what's going on. No wonder they need lots because <laughs> they're buying them in blocks of 12, these ladies. Have you ever tried one? Do you like them? Very traditional. Very traditional. Traditional. Wow, the big rush for food is over. Huh? Sold out. Sold out. Okay, well, now this could be a good marketing scam. 15 minutes. 15 minutes. Let's hope we can come back for some beautiful little 
mushroom style dough with holes in the middle and you call them wo wo tao? Okay, we're gonna be looking for our friend Gaway now. If you see at the end of this video that I'm trying one of those snacks, that meant that we stuck around for 50 minutes or maybe we'll just go grab our buddy Gaway and bring him back to sample the food anyway. I want to tell you guys to like, share, and subscribe. This is Alex in the City on the southern part of this fantastic, booming Montropolis city of Chongqing. As you can see, thanks for watching. Take care.